Hi, I'm Jane Mullitz, and I'm here from Halifax, Nova Scotia in Canada. Uh, I work at the Sobe School of Business at St. Mary's University on our accreditation uh, and other quality initiatives. I am here with uh, Margaret McKee, a faculty member in our ethics department, to explore the feasibility of uh, implementing the principles for responsible management education. I'm feeling very confident that uh, the two of us will be able to take back um, some very practical suggestions for moving towards implementation. Um, and the time that we've spent here together, uh, both in the workshop setting and with colleagues um, outside of the workshop setting has proven to be uh, extremely valuable and, and worthwhile. My name is Margaret McKee and I'm an associate professor at the Sobe School of Business, uh, which is in Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada. I'm here with my colleague Jane Malatz. Uh, we are an AACSB accredited school and we're looking for ways to further integrate ethics across our curriculum. We would learned about the Prime initi Initiative and we were interested in becoming signatories but we wanted to have a sense of what is the commitment before getting on board and also get some sense of what our school's doing relative to Prime. What's been great about the time here uh, is that we've had a chance to hear firsthand from Kai and his colleagues about things that they're doing today. Uh, we've also learned about their experiences with initiatives, say for instance like Responsibility Day, which is a case-wide competition that they've introduced with all of their business school students and it puts a real focus on responsible management education. They've been very forthcoming about the things that have worked and the things that have haven't so that we have some sense of, of how we might learn from their experience and incorporate such an initiative at our school. And there are many other examples that I could use. That's been the best part of this program. My name is Alison. I'm the Associate Dean of the Faculty of Business at the Hong Kong Polytechnic University. As a relatively uh, new signatory to Prime, in fact, we have only uh, been with Prime now for six months. Uh, we've come to this program mainly to uh, learn from the very best, I would say. Uh, CBS is a school that has essentially lived and, and really permeated Prime uh, through and through. I think at this particular program, one of the key uh, benefits that I would draw from it is really our session with one of the faculty members of CBS where he presented a very different uh, viewpoint and in fact the oppositions uh, that would be expected towards the implementation of Prime. For us this is crucial because this gives us very good insight into the types of opposition, all the types of voices uh, that are against this type of initiative and in fact helps us to better prepare uh, for how we plan to implement uh, Prime and gain the inspiration of our colleagues. I'm Lutz Schlange from uh, University of Applied Sciences in Coeur, Switzerland. We're an early adopter of Prime initiative uh, since 2009. I'm coordinating this initiative uh, at my institution and uh, I signed up to this program because it uh, helps me to uh, reflect upon what we've achieved so far and where we're headed uh, with respect to our global exposure and the peer group that uh, I'm meeting here and interacting with. My name is Jürg Kessler. I'm Rector and Vice-Chancellor from the University of Applied Sciences Kur in Switzerland. I'm here with my colleague Lutz Schlange and for me as a Rector it's very important to see ideas, to have a concept, to implement the ideas, the aspects from Prime into the modules, into the lecture. And so it's very important the discussions with colleagues from all over the world to see how they have implemented in their universities. I sit uh, in the Secretariat in New York and most of the work that we do while we work very hard is a bit generic, answering questions about uh, reporting. Why do I report? How do I report? Can I use the logo? Did I use the logo properly? Uh, and so the opportunity meet for me personally coming to an implementation workshop is to see the active engagement on the ground of individuals interacting. So an idea coming from Iceland is inspiring someone in Portugal who says, oh, I can do 
the same thing in my institution. And of course, they're not doing the exact same thing, but the, the inspiration is really tangible in this kind of workshop and inspiring for me uh, to take back home to New York.